Hello, Taylor. How are you? I have to tell you that I am so proud of you, Taylor. I am so proud of all the hard work that you have done the past couple of weeks with your articles, okay? You did a lot of work. You went above and beyond what I expected you to do, and I am really, really proud of you. I know it was difficult. I know it was challenging, but you did not quit. You did not give up. You stuck with it, and you know what that's called, Taylor? That's called integrity, and I am super proud of you. So way to go. I just want you to know that I am really, really pleased with the work that I've been seeing from you. You are amazing. Now this week I'm going to give you an assignment that's kind of a little bit lighter, a little bit easier, and a lot of fun. I am going to send you to a website that I really like, okay? So I'm going to send you to Study Jams. Now, you may have already used this in school. I don't know. That's the one thing that's that's a little tricky about being far away from you is I don't know what websites you usually go to. So if you already know Study Jams, that's awesome. And if you don't, you're going to love it because I'm going to introduce it to you today. Okay. Now, inside of Study Jams, there's about 10 different topics that you can click on. So I want you to find a topic that interests you. And inside of that topic, there's a bunch of little subtopics. And when you click on those, there will be videos for you to watch. And they're really cool. They're animated videos, and they're only about four minutes long. But you know what, Taylor? You're going to be really surprised at the amount of information that you can get from a four-minute video, from a video. Not from an article, not from a story, not from text, but from a video. That's our lesson this week is there's other sources of information that we can use to gather facts. Now, the first time you watch the video, I just want you to watch it through from the beginning to the end. Okay, and look and listen and see what the video is trying to tell you. Then I'm going to have you watch it a second time through. And when you watch it for the second time, you're going to need to have a pencil and paper. And you're going to need to pause the video as you watch it to take notes to tell me what's going inside of the video. Okay? Then you're going to use those notes, Taylor. You're going to use those notes to write your information this week. Okay? Now, when you go to do your writing, it'll be about two paragraphs long. Okay? But you will be surprised at how many facts that you've gathered just from a video. Now, you don't have to cite your source. I already know what the source is. The source is Study Jams. You just need to write about all the cool things that you're learning from a different source, from a video. Normally, we would go to a book or to an article, but it's really cool to be able to use videos and other sources of information to gather facts about your topic. Okay, so again, I'm super proud of all that hard work you did with paraphrasing. Way to go. Your writing is looking amazing. Okay, and I will attach the link to the Study Jams website in this email for you, okay? So you have a great day, and you have a great week, and I'll be talking to you really, really soon. Okay, Taylor? Bye.